Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to change the colors of the Asus ROG logo in the motherboard and as well as the uh, Tough series of the RTX 3060 graphics card. And both are supported with the Asus Aura Sync. So you can able to change the colors uh, using the Asus Armory Crate application. Well, firstly, to make this, so you have to install the Asus Armory Crate application. So for that, you have to just go to the Google Chrome browser and just search for the Armory Crate. And here is the first link, Armory Crate ROG Asus. So this is the site and then just uh, click on the download option. And after that, uh, so now here, just select the OS and after that, just click on the download and that's it now the download pages actually comes so just save this and after that just install the asus armory create application and i have already downloaded and installed so once you have installed after opening so this is the asus armory create application so this is a rog version and this can be also supported for the tough version in case if your motherboard is actually supported with the aura sync means you can able to change the colors and otherwise you can't able to change the colors only the default rgb colors only will be available well now this is the home page this is the dashboard of the access hormary crate so here you have to select the aura sync and uh, here is a sync devices so i have actually synced three devices one is a rock strix uh, b550 gaming motherboard and then the asus tough series asus rtx 3060 uh, graphics card and both these devices actually supported with the asus aura sync and then uh, addressable led strip and this strip is actually not supported with the aura sync so i am just disable this and after that now just select the aura fx and this is that so here is some of the basic effects so using this basic effect you can uh, use uh, like this uh, modes different modes so one is a static breathing strobing so static means a fixed colors so once you have tapped that after that selecting uh, different color you can able to select uh, so green red pink so based on that the color variance will be actually changed and after that the next one is the breathing so by selecting this mode actually you've seen this the color will be actually looks like a breathing effect and also you here is the option random once you selected so random colors will be appeared uh, automatically and also you can uh, select a fixed color also by disabling random after that you can select the fixed color and just click on the ok now you get the fixed color in the breathing mode and then a strobing so it's a uh, blinking fastly so that is a strobing mode and then a color cycle so it will uh, it's actually uh, related to the random uh, colors so once you select a color cycle mode so random colors will be appeared in a certain seconds and then a rainbow so it's a rainbow color so colors will be looks like a radiant color effect you will get in the both uh, rog uh, motherboard and then uh, geforce rtx so based on your devices you will get like this color effects and then a starry night so it is a one type of a color variant uh, so you can uh, select uh, random colors also for that and also you can here adjust the speed for this mode so if you adjust the speed to the maximum the color will be blinks fastly and after that music so once you have enabled so this uh, actually this color will be uh, works only after you have uh, played some of the musics only so i am just uh, go to the youtube now and then uh, just play some of the videos uh, and uh, i am just playing these videos so once you have played the audio so based on that uh, you will see the color effects so now the color effects will be shown and also you can select the pattern also so so whenever you are playing a music that time only the color effects will be actually comes well now let's turn off the audio so i am just uh, disabling the audio and once i have disabled so now actually seen that uh, the color will be actually automatically disabled so you will not get any color effects so whenever you are playing music that time only the colors will be blinks in the both the devices and then uh, once i am switch to the smart mode so this is the smart mode so it is a important uh, uh, setting actually so once you have selected the smart board so here is uh, some of the option by cpu temperature by cpu usage and then gpu temperature so by selecting the cpu temperature so here is uh, some of the points that means a low point means 40 degrees celsius high point means 60 degrees celsius so that means whenever the cpu computing more power means so if the temperature high means it will blinks a yellow color so currently the temperature at the high point so at 60 degrees celsius so that then so that's why it's 
actually brings yellow color so if the temperature it's a low point that's having only 40 degrees celsius means then the color is actually switched to the green color and also you can adjust the temperature for the colors like you can set the temperature limit for each one like i am actually setting uh, so 60 degree as the normal temperature so like i am selecting 63 degree celsius as a low point and above 63 degree celsius will be set as a high point so that means 74 degree celsius is actual so that is a high point but now 63 degree celsius is set as a low point so that's why you will get the color effects like a green color so that's the thing so like this you can set that so using this you can set your preferences like uh, what will be your low power point temperature and what will be the high point temperature so like that you can switches means so based on the colors changes you can alert and you can configure a cpu temperature and based on that you can also do that for your gpu temperature also for the gpu temperature the low point is 60 degree and the high point is 85 degree celsius now the uh, gpu geforce rtx is actually blinking a green color light only so that means it's under 60 degree celsius so if it is actually goes uh, beyond our uh, around 85 degrees celsius means so it blinks a uh, yellow color so that is this mode and then uh, adaptive color mode so it is uh, depends upon the screen you are using so now the display is uh, now that uh, it's not shows any colors so once i am uh, goes back uh, and uh, go to the desktop means so here it shows some of the colors uh, and once i refresh now it shows the pink color so again i am going to the chrome browser here it shows some colors and uh, i'll show you some other thing so just go to the paint i am just going to the paint and here i am filling up the red color well in the paint section now i am selected the red color so once i have filled the red color so the lighting will be changes to red and after that i am just putting the yellow color so lighting will be changes to yellow and then uh, i am putting the blue color so the lighting will be changes to blue color so based on the co colors available in the display in your desktop so based on that the colors will be changes in the both the asus rock b50 uh, motherboard and then graphics card so that is called the adaptive uh, so that is called the adaptive mode and then the dark mode so once you have selected so that means uh, no color will be blinks so during the night time you can uh, switch to the uh, dark mode so once you have set it, so no rgb lighting effects will be happen in the both the devices and you can also sync the devices based on your wishes in case if you don't want to do for the tufts uh, 3060 means i am just disabling that so once i have disabled that so currently the mode is in the dark mode so only the access rock b550 motherboard only doesn't have uh, any rgb lighting effect but the geforce rtx is having the lighting effects since uh, because uh, it's not synced with the aura sync devices that's why and after i am enabling that so again it goes off so these are the basic effects change the colors to the access rock b50 motherboard and also you can change the colors for the different supported devices so the devices should be supported with the access aura sync or the access aura creator and in the next video i'll show how to do the aura creator so using the aura creator application you can do lot more uh, using the devices so currently the asus rock b50 motherboard and tough uh, 3060 graphics card both are supported with the asus uh, aura creator so using the aura creator you can able to somehow you can able to create a, a specific set of uh, rgb lighting effects i'll show you in the next video well overall, well, overall that's all about this video guys and hopefully if you guys like like this video hit the like button and if you guys like to watch my upcoming videos hit the subscribe button below and thanks for watching this video guys Bye.